Hi guys, welcome back to Birmingham Fan TV and today it's Reading at home. Is it Reading at home? Yeah, it's Reading at home. Uh, it's set for a good attendance tonight. I think we're looking at 24,000 plus. Um, first time in a while, Wes has got his music banging out. Let's hope for a good three points tonight, take us into the top half of the table. Massive game, good attendance. Really don't want to be losing to a team like Reading. So guys, I will see you at the ground. I think we're going to thrash them. No, I don't. I think it's going to be a really tough game it's again. A tight game, I think. It's always a tight game against the teams that it shouldn't be a tight Yay. game against. <laughs> it's always a tight game. It shouldn't be a tight game against them. But that makes me feel like if we are a different team now to what we keep thinking we are. Um, and what we haven't before, we might just do it this game. I think this this is the sort of game where you understand the type of team that we are now. Where's Lee? Where's Lee? What were you trying? Oh god, <laughs> evening. Where's pre-match prediction? Go. Uh, 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 typically blues. Uh, it's a kind of game that we could uh, easily, easily get beat. But I'm just thinking, not tonight. Score. Uh, 2-0 Blues. Scores. Banks and Duke. Looking forward to it. Absolutely uh, freezing me nuts up. Look who's back. Fresh from his holiday. All the way from Greece. Looks like Gino De Campo now, doesn't it? You missed the Stoke game. You haven't even, I don't even think you've seen the highlights. Go on. What's your, score, predi all, what's your score prediction? I'm going to play it safe. I'm going to go for a 0-0 draw. Again. Um, worst case scenario, Lee Camp's going to fumble it in his own net. Best case scenario, Lee Camp scores from a goal kick. <laughs> so you're going with a nil-nil? Yeah, definitely. You're going with a nil-nil yeah. and a Lee Camp special. I think it's going to be a boring draw unless the, uh, the World 26 or whatever they are run on the pitch and the game gets abandoned. You're looking forward to this one? I'm very scared. But we're unbeaten. Be scared, Chaz. Grow up. in the last one.
first half thoughts? Oh my god, that's sketchy. Charlie. I want to be back in Corfu. Go on, who's going to win it? Go. Do you know what's scary? We had You predicted nil nil and Lee Camp to have a fumble. Nil nil and Lee Camp almost put it in the back of his own net for a shot. I think Tyler Blackett's going to score. Really, really. Tyler Blackett. Final score prediction? Nil nil. Still nil nil. Yeah. Thoughts on first half? I don't have any. One of those ones, like it was against Stoke, and it's quite boring first half. Um, not really many talking points. We were on top for the first 20 minutes, and then we dropped off again. Full time prediction? 1 0 blue.
So guys, just back from the game. Fantastic win. Um, thoroughly enjoyed that, especially the second half performance. I thought that we were fully deserved winners in the end. A um, little bit of scare at the end with Mita, but um, some fantastic goals. Proper team ethic. I think the fans were fantastic again tonight. And uh, long may it continue, I feel like. You just don't see this run coming to an end at the minute. 12 unbeaten at home. Let's make it 13 at the weekend. Let's keep this unbeaten run going. We're climbing up the table. We're up to ninth in the league now, which is outstanding. Point after playoffs. And if results go our way on Saturday and we win, we could be into the playoffs for the weekend. So, guys, do enjoy the rest of the week. Make sure you're down there on Saturday at St Andrews. Let's get the place rocking again. Fantastic atmosphere tonight. And let's make it four wins on the bounce on Saturday, guys. Keep right on. Yeah.